Hey guys, my name is Ryan. Um, I'm just gonna talk about the worst road trip I ever had in my life to date so far. Okay. Um, it was. It all goes back a couple of years ago. Um, it was just starting off with me and my buddies. We uh, we enjoy doing shrooms a lot. Um, I've done shrooms over like 30 times in my lifetime. Anyways. Um, we get together and we, uh, link up with a group of fucking people, like, acquaintances. But my buddy's friends, not so much mine. So, we take, uh, the shrooms in the path and we meet up with these guys. Anyway, um, we get to my buddy's house and we're sitting around, chilling out, and... There's like a fucking storm going on at this time, and it's a groomy day. Everyone, we go out to the park in the storm, what a stupid idea that was. Anyway, there's like nine of these guys, and they kept on repeating everything I would say, and make me feel terrible about myself because I was on shrooms. These guys were not on anything, they might have had one sip of alcohol, and they just seemed depressed as fuck the whole fucking time. Anyway, as I was with my friends, they were feeling the same way as me too. Anyway, um, so the guys just made me feel like shit, and uh, they put me down, they made me feel like I wasn't worthy. So, in my mind at the time, I felt like the only way I run, first of all, I run away, and I don't, and I run away, and as I'm running away, I look back, and there's no one there, I have no idea where I am, and at that time, I thought the only way out of this fucking trip was if I would kill myself. I had no idea where I was, what I was doing, where to go. I was terrified. And this was like on four grams of shrooms. Um, so I eventually find my buddies again. And we go back to this house. Um, we're laying down in my buddy's room with these guys. And they're still treating me, mind fucking me, just mind looping me constantly. Um, we put on the movie Dodgeball, and recommended never watch that movie on shrooms, because at the time of my trip period, um, the movie would just keep on repeating itself constantly, it would never fucking end. And it was pretty fucking weird how that happened, because usually fucking doesn't happen like that. Um, it would just keep on repeating stuff constantly and constantly. I fucking was going loopy and didn't know what to think, who was to do, you know, kind of thing. And the guy, the number one guy that treated me like the worst, um... I'm not sure if he was purposely tripping us out or it was the drug. I have no idea. But he would say he would be leaving and not coming back. And then he would eventually just come right back in the room after he said he left. And that wasn't the fucking first time that happened either. He did it again and again and again. And then he eventually left. But that shit don't happen. You know what I mean? Like, fuck. So eventually, this was like four hours in, um, everything was just fucked, um, swear the bad vibes completely, everyone seemed suicidal towards me, um, but eventually I knew it was just the drug and it was gonna wear off, so then I just pretty much slept in the living room and just looked at the walls swerving at me until it all worn off and I passed out. But anyways, that was probably the worst trip of my life to date and um, just wanted to share that with you guys. Hopefully it made sense. Um, yeah, so have fun and stay safe when you do this stuff and uh, just go with a clear mind and be with your best friends. No sketch bags, no anti-people. Just going with a clear mind and uh, 
just friendly people be around and go to a nice secure place and uh, that's all I got to say about that and uh, yeah that's my video.